Yes, my master. Hello there, and welcome to another Rumple video. As requested by a good, close guild member of mine, Cold, this is for you. Um, we're going to go over mods in detail here. Uh, mods can be unlocked at level 50. That's when all the fun begins. Before level 50, you can acquire tier 1 and tier 2 mods in the mod shop. After level 50, the mod battles open up and you can require tier 1 and tier mods as well in the battles. But don't waste your time trying to get 3 stars in there so you can get tier 1 and tier 2 mods. Go to the mod challenge. You get, once you finish the battles in there, you can get all the way to your MK5. That's in the third battle in each challenge. And I will show you that once we get to the gooey part of this, the game part, the fun part. Uh, so, some of this you can read. I'm not going to go over some of this. Um, there is a difference between offense flat, defense flat, speed flat, and offense percentage and those percentages. Say your Ray had 2,000 physical damage. If you gave her 1% somewhere on that mod, it would go up 20, so she'd have 2,020. If you had a mod that didn't have a percentage, but it had 30 flat, it would be at 230. Now, if you had a mod that had 20 flat, it'd be the same as a percentage. Now, I'm not saying one is better than the other, but in the arrow mod, the top right corner, when you're needing speed and you're needing that in a flat, that's the place to get it. But as far as your secondaries, sometimes a percentage can outweigh the flat. It, I can't say what's better. That depends on what tune you're wanting, working on, and what you're wanting. So that can change. Um, the symbol in the middle of the mod is what activates the set bonuses. So you learn the symbol and know what that symbol is, and that will be your bonus. Um, the number of mods required to get a set bonus depends on that particular mod type. Health requires two mods. You could actually have three set bonuses of health mods in on your tune. Um, you may also purchase mods in the mod shop for crystals or credits. Uh, and that opens up at level 50 like I said. Okay, that pretty much kind of covers page one here, basic information. Page two gets better and three gets better and then we'll get into the game. Alrighty, thank you. Now we'll move to page three. Two. Okay, sheet two. Mods come in tiers, one through five. Quality, A through E, which is the color, and level, one through 15. You could say gold would be a quality of A, and then the colors would go down, purple, blue, blue green, gray. They also come in different shapes. Excuse my um, fix there. Arrow is the receiver. Square is a transmitter. Triangle is the holo arrow array. Diamond is a processor. A cross is a multiplexer. And a circle is a data bus. Now at this particular moment, I don't know the extent detail what each one of those detail or what they their, um, what they represent. I will find out and get with that later. But an example of how the tiers work. A T5 gray is 5 star Level 1 mod has no secondary stats. Now if you had a T5 green that you go find, a 5 star green one, level 1, it will have one stat, secondary stat. If you find a blue T5, 5 star, level 1, it will have two stats. A purple, level 1, and so on, three stats. So, if you find a T5 gold, yes, gold starts at early, you will have four secondary stats, which means you have already know what stats you're getting. Sometimes that's better, and usually it is better, so I don't even want any stats. I don't even mess with it. Um, okay, I will show you in, when we go look at the um, game, we'll look at the mods, and I'll show you there how that works. But that's how the tiers work. So the higher the tier, the higher the stat. Tier 1 and Tier 2 mods you get from most mod battles. 
You get tier one, two. I've not seen any tier one mods out of the challenge yet. So it's been two, three, four, and five that I've been getting from the challenges. All mods turn gold at level 12. So if you had a green T5 level 1 and you leveled that up to level 11, you would have three stats. You would get your fourth stat when it turns gold and then it will stay gold. All your secondary stats will be maxed out. From level 12 to max, the only thing that changes is the primary stat. Excuse me. T1 through all T5, they all have secondary stats. Almost every mod, like I said, at level 12 and beyond has all four secondary stats. And this is how the stats will, will come. This is how you will get secondary stats. At level 3, you get a stat. Level 6, you get a stat. Level 9, you get a stat. So you could say in level 12, you get your last stat. This is on a gray mod. Ah, okay. So, all right. so, speed, like I said, is the only flat as a primary on the arrow receiver. Um, all the other ones are a percentage. I have only found speed in the mod shop. Like I said, I have not found it in the challenge or a battle. Um... All mods reach gold at level, yeah, okay. All mods will eventually reach quality, yeah, okay. So I, I, I don't know what notes I had in here, but let's go over to page three. Okay, page three. Arrow mods can have speed, accuracy, offense, off, and so forth, percentage or flat as a primary stat. Square mods will always have offense as a primary stat. I've never seen anything else on a, on a square mod. Triangle mods can have crit percent, crit damage, offense, and you can see right there in the chart what it can have as primary. Diamond mods always have a defense as primary. I've never seen any difference. The plus mods can have potency, tenacity, offense, offense percent, defense flat, defense percent, as you can see. And circle mods can have HP or protection, that's health, or protection as a primary. So the first things I was just talking about are what all your mods could have as a primary or what they will have as a primary. Now, square mods, okay, I already said that. All right, have a circle mods. Well. <clears throat> now, the secondaries, they could be anything. I have not seen any repetition or pattern on that it's just been kind of random on what secondary you're going to get the stats can be split into two categories the way i kind of put them a basic and a special your basic would be offense offense percent defense defense percent health health percent protection and protection percent then your specials would be speed accuracy percent crit void percent crit damage potent potency and tenacity so that's for page three. Okay, here we are, the mods. Let's see. We'll start with um, the tiers and the colors and all of that. And what do we got here? There, an MK5. That's MK4. There's an MK5. Level one. No secondaries. Okay, MK5, level 1, no secondaries. MK5, level 1, green, one secondary. MK5, level 1, two secondaries. MK5, level 11. Maybe I don't have one. I thought that was a level one. Because I've leveled some. Well, you get the idea. Because there's a level one right here. 
MK5. It only has two. The green MK5 only has one. And I haven't got to level 12 on the blue yet. Oh, wait, 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 there's one. No, that's oh, purple, I mean. So, well, here, I'll show you. We'll go ahead. Is anything better I can upgrade? <sighs> okay. We'll do this one. You will get that fourth at 12. There it is. Three speed. Now, none of them secondary stats are going to increase when you, uh, all the way to level 15. You can stop right here and say, okay, I'm going to try. That's what I do. I stop at level 12. Okay, now I got all four. What do I want to do? The only thing you'll be missing out is you'll be getting like 5% of your um, set bonus because they're not all the way level 15. But just to test out, stop is a lot of money. So that's why I stopped. But now you got to see at level 12, you get that four stat. So while farming, and there's, you know, gold, MK5, yes, level one. You can, Gold is at level one. It just means these stats will be stronger than any other color what you when you get to when this gets to an uh, level 15 this will be a strong mod all those things let me see I want to do that one we'll do this one just a couple my offense by level 9 is jumped to 114 so this isn't the best of mod uh, I wanted to show you but if you had three or all four good secondary stats at a gold level level one and you upgraded oh man so I'm not going any further and waste more money but look at 114 offense so that's the difference in finding a gold level one way stronger and they'll be way stronger at 15 oh, so real quick once again MK5 gray level one nothing MK5 level 1 green 1 MK5 level 1 blue 2 and go look at your own purple there will be 3 and then go all the way up okay that's that um, over to now as far as what mod to use on what tune man I can't tell you that um, everybody plays different your own way of playing, you know, because I know the way I play is different. I'm using Jedi's, and someone using Rebels is not going to want potency mods. Um, using Sith, I need potency. I'm trying to use my Sith Lord magic, whatever, uh, on you, and I need the potency to inflict it. Um, I would say Rebels probably want offense, speed, and some defense, or whatever, but they're not trying to get any potency. So, mod battles. Um, don't concern yourself with, with three star in this. It's crazy. It, look at look at that. Possible rewards, MK1 and MK2 mods. You ain't gonna get any better out of these either. Get through it. Get it done. Go to the challenge. As you can see, the last one, Battle Eight. I didn't three star. St I didn't care. No big deal. So, but I got it done. What did all that do? Getting through all of those eight battles. Well. That opened up all my challenges. Okay. Now I'm going to break one rule or what you might be thinking out there. When you sim right here, when you pass, or I would say sim, tier three, you get three star here. Oh, that sim the wrong word. When you battle tier three in here and get three star, you will unlock every five star category of mods there is in the mod shop so if you want to go shopping you are now capable of getting any mod you want at the five star level in the mod shop just by getting um, three star in right here so that's one thing to do and this is the easiest help you can use all your tunes so this is the first thing I'm sure everybody gets is the five star health but they're only going to last you so long. As you level up, you will need other mods and so forth. Um, the Jedi. I three started the tier three as well because I'm a Jedi player, so that was easy. So I've got crazy health and defense mods. But 
when I got them upper levels of PvP, it only helped so much. I needed the potency. Well, I don't have a lot of empire, empire tunes. Um, so I was only able to three star tier two. So I've got MK4 potencies as um, I'll show you. I should have went and done it was in tunes. But I want, to, I want you to see, I have not three starred MK5s. We will go look in the, Mashar, the mod shop and you will see I have choices to get MK5 potency mods. I ain't got any crit three stars at all. Um, see, we'll go to the shard shop. I mean, mod shop. I can get MK5s all day. All because I three starred this. So, if you got money, big fat gold, three star this, you go to the shop, you can buy whatever you want. Uh, that's that. Um, to the shard shop. Time today. All right. Mod shop. Sorry, not the best commentator. Um, there's a tenacity, uh, tenacity four star. I ain't done it right there. Potency. We were just in there. MK5. I did not three star that. Here they are. Three star that tier three health challenge. You can come right in here and buy whatever you want. There's a potency MK5. There's a critical chance mk5 i showed you i did not so there you go that myth has been busted i read a lot of that on forums um so no that's not the way it is you do not have to get them all um and that's about it oh we'll go back here I'll show you some of the ones i'm proud of i had to buy i mean we were in here already but um MK5 potency, 30 speed, 100 offense. Like I was telling you, if you had one of them gold MK5 level one, you like I showed you, you will get these kind of stats. But I bought this. I did not get this in a challenge. My MK4 potency, it's pretty good. 16% protection, 33 offense, 3 speed. I've got some good ones there. Um, yes, it is. I do not have a lot of MK5s to show you. Look right here. Darth Maul's got a de oh yeah defense. It's not easy for me to get. 30 speed. I bought that. Did not get that in a challenge. The rest of his are forward and his speed sets three because I ain't starred any three starred any of those. I desperately want those speeds. Qui-Gon's four star, Sidious uh, four star, but now Sidious' potencies I've gotten from the challenge, and thank the Lord I did get that, 26 speed, no I bought that, I'm going to keep repeating, I have not found any flat speed receivers in challenges, they've all been bought, in. so take note of that, the rest of these, they came from the challenge, I ain't bought any of these. All these came from challenges, but that primary one, that's a good one. So, this is the kind of stuff you can get. You know, an 8% defense, that's pretty good on MK4. It'd be like 11% on MK5. So this is the kind of stuff you can get from the challenges. Well, I think that about covers everything that I can think of. I'm at the my sound is vibrating I do apologize I'm thinking I'm having tablet issues my only fix may be to buy a new tablet I will try to get the sound as best I can thanks for watching and there's a lot of information in here if I've left anything out let me know have a good day